I think it might be time. What's up, brother? Holy heck, did I just see that? Did I see that live? What's up, brother? What's up, brother? Look at him gearing up. Do you reckon this like... will be too big on me, Deccan? Do you reckon it will go up? We'll need a tight end for Yeah. Go. And off he goes. Hola, hombres. It is super windy. Uh, we're coming into Hulhumale. This Hulhumale harbour, where we're meant to be anchoring, is looking pretty hectic. No, not looking. It is hectic. Trying to find a spot to anchor here is very difficult. It is so packed. As we like to say, it's like Oniroa Bay on Christmas. Oniroa Bay is a very popular bay on an island just outside Auckland, New Zealand, that everyone goes to at Christmas time. And yeah, it's, it's, uh, this place is packed. It looks like we may have found a spot. Easy peasy, that wasn't even stressful. We went in and the anchor was down like that. Mandam's out here gonna play some footy and that. Show us some skills, bro. almost lost my kite in the back of a taxi, we had to go get it fixed. That day that I went out kiting, when I was bringing the kite back in, I actually popped it on the wind generator. Stupid. Mum, Ivan, Dad went into Mali, 
did some shopping, got the kite fixed, brought it back in a taxi. They got out of the taxi, forgot it was in the boot, and left it. Went to the police station, they got it back. Anyway, and now we're playing some footy. If an Australian heard me say that, they'd think I'm playing AFL. But no, we're playing some football, soccer. My camera's about to die. Paratas. Such an easy to make, yummy little thing. Mm. They're kind of funny things because you have to pull them right out of the freezer and then straight into the pan. Otherwise, the base, the dough, just melts. Ah, uh, then tell us the step. And so, what are we doing actually? Well, I'm teaching Dad how to do a backflip. Um, kind of. I'm trying to get him to do kind of like a side dive. So stand, stand square and then kind of just as you're gonna do it. So go standing like as you're gonna do a backflip. And then just before you kind of swing, think of looking over your shoulder as you go, and then diving so you go like, like that, and then dive. And make sure you go out. Can I, ask, can I get you to demo me? Yeah. I don't want to do this actually, but I'm just doing it anyway, because apparently I should. I should learn how to do this. In fact, probably you guys should learn how to do this too. But I don't so, really, I don't, I don't need to learn this. I will anyway. Garvey. And I might enjoy it, but I may not. Okay. Yuppie, yuppie, yuppie. So you can kind of go like that with your hands. You swing out. Give you that kind of rotation around. Oh, yeah. And then just kind of go. Oh, ah, I saw something else. Back. He talked about his, his arms, but what I saw him do too was he went down and he crouched and he pushed off as he swung. So I'm going to do that. Yeah, ready? Go. Because you pushed your legs. I saw you. Yeah, yeah, you got to push yeah. up. You've got to jump. He didn't oh, say yeah. that for you. Guys learning this. Well, yeah, you've got to use your legs as well. That's kind of like... Oh, you didn't say that. <laughs> what? What do you think I'm going to do? Just my arms? Yeah. <laughs> no. Don't say it. You're not going to do it. Okay, all right, here we go. I thought that one was pretty self-explanatory. You've got to oh, use your legs. Self not too much. <laughs> you don't need too much spin. Yeah. Wow. That didn't feel good. Try to get your legs over your head more. What do I do wrong there, Declan? Uh, well, yeah, you, you gotta know? like commit to going over more. Yeah. Like go, uh, you know how if you're doing a dive straight down into the water, that's what yeah. you wanna do. You wanna try and get straight down into the water because you yes. just kinda jump out. Yeah, okay. Yeah. So I gotta go up and uh, up and over, yeah. Yeah, yeah over. Look, yeah. Over. yeah. You look over, over, you're looking over your shoulder as over. you're doing it. Over. Yeah, and I go. jump and, and lift, let my legs lift yeah. up. Yeah. Like this. There they go. Yeah. Like that. Is that not what I did? No, no not quite. <laughs> yeah. yeah! This takes you really good. Yeah, yeah that, that was good. Yeah, that was yeah, way that better. Was good. Good. Yeah, that's what you need to do. Very good. That, that was, was like good. perfect. Oh, he's unstoppable. A little bit slappy. As you slowly get more comfortable doing that, try and delay that 180 to going yeah. onto your stomach. Oh, that was, oh yeah. That was a backflip pretty much. Is that what you're saying? For a second, right. yeah. Like for a, a second, I thought yeah. you were about to do a backflip. It's not better. Yeah. yeah. I thought like more like I was going more. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> I thought yeah. you were going to do a backflip. It sort of felt like that, actually, yeah. Backflip with a slight left bias. Right, yeah. here we go. Yeah. 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 Hey! That was a back dive. That was a back dive. Was that that no, was pretty that much was a... That was a back dive. That was a halfway. You're halfway yeah. there. Yeah. Yeah. Holy crap, well, I couldn't see a thing. I don't know if I can just push off like this, though. Nah, no, maybe not. Yeah. Might just do it now. <sighs> Whoops. He's dead. He's dead. He's dead. Oh, he's oh no, he died. Yeah. Go. Grab like that. And then just hold it. Really. <laughs> you had him there. Oh, he died again. So <laughs> good. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that one looks like a hat. This is 
some proper entertainment. Dad just keeps going and going and going. He's probably done about over 20 backflips now. <laughs> he just keeps doing it, getting out, doing it again, getting out, going again. He's committed, that's for sure. Consistency is key. Dad has got that key. Oh! I mean, that was... That one, you, you definitely went up. What a learning! 60! And still learning! Dad just learned how to do a backflip at 60. Wonders will never cease. Never too young to learn. Do you have a, a final any, any final message words? for the people? You know what? I have been putting this off. I was about to say for a decade. It, it's almost a decade that I've been putting this off. It's so stupid. So I was going, ah, I don't want to learn how to do that. What do I want to do this? Yeah, yeah, it looks like fun, but ah, uh, yeah. Anyone can do that, <laughs> kind of thing. Today, I decided, let's learn how to do a back flip, no, back dive. I just wanted to learn how to do that divey thing, and then it became a back flip as well. And I, to be fair, I haven't learned how to do a back flip, that's fine. But look, uh, anyone can do it, I don't, you don't, you can, anyone can do this. With the right tutelage, and a bit of, um, let's do this thing. I don't know, what, what, I've always, actually, to be fair, I've, I have had an element of fear to it. To be fair, I've had some fear attached to having a go. Isn't that funny? I've done a lot of stuff that's, um, you know, kind of semi-extreme. And yet I've had a, a smidgen of... I think there's this fear of failure that I think a lot, of, a lot of us have that stop us from really excelling and really having a go, or at least having a go. You know what? There's no wrong, nothing wrong with failure. And that's the problem. Maybe it's fear of failure, not with fear. Fear of failure, I think, is the biggest thing that's hindering us all, or most of us, from giving a crack at something new. Everyone gets it wrong the first time. How's a baby start to crawl? How's a baby start to walk? They don't get it right first time. It's exactly the same for everything else in life. And uh, yeah, I think I've just learned to crawl. <laughs> yeah. You. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Walking in a couple of days. Thank you.